Shall we have a quick conversation about the top seven bank personal lines of credit with easy approval? Don't go anywhere. You're going to love today's conversation. I guarantee it. Welcome back, folks, to another edition of the Awesome Sort of Kiwi Show. How are you today? I hope you are doing fantastic. I'm doing marvelous, if you ever ask me. If you are doing as great as I am, go grab a cup of coffee or tea or vodka. Now, let's roll. In today's conversation, I want to speak to you about the top seven bank personal lines of credit with easy approval. Number seven, we have a TD Bank. Our score, eight over ten. So when you think about TD Bank, I want you to think about an institution that will lend you up to uh, $50,000. So actually, the loan amounts, the lines amount, rather, go from $20,000 to $50,000. And this is unsecured, not a problem, okay? So you, you just need to have a relationship with the bank. You need to have an account with them, either at the personal level or at the business level, and they'll take care of you. You can access the money whenever you need. It, this is no restriction here. You can use your line of credit all at once or a little over time, depending on the uh, transaction, depending on the agreement you have with uh, TD Bank. And you can also use uh, your line of credit for home improvements, large purchases, or expect unexpected expenses. What we love really with TD Bank is that they will be able to work with you depending on your situation. And their requirements are not really that that uh, strict. They they will ask for uh, obviously they will ask for uh, income income. Uh, requirements they will ask for income limits they will ask for uh, some kind of um, some kind of uh, explanation they're not going they're not going to ask you to secure the line of credit this is unsecured okay so with an unsecured line of credit you don't need to use your home or other assets to borrow money and so we are speaking speaking about personal lines of credits here so lines go from twenty thousand dollars to fifty thousand dollars if you want a lower amount you can get it but you have to go to a branch you have to sit with the loan officer and let's say you're asking for ten thousand dollars instead of twenty grand so they will uh, they will ask you why do you have to uh, to rationalize the the decision you have to explain to them why and we love the fact that with td bank you have a, a low rate this is really good you can access your line of credit for 10 years just, just think about it in terms of uh, personal budgeting or in terms of family budgeting having this sort of a uh, line of credit for 10 years is kind of cool especially when you have uh, abs and flows in your budget you want to be able to plug the the, the chasms the holes that you know uh, lack of money sometimes may cause to your to your budget so we love that and uh, the apr can go as low as 8.25 percent and the monthly payment can go as low as 500 dollars. okay 500 dollars. so make sure that you think twice before getting this line of credit obviously we are speaking about fifty thousand dollars maximum limit so if you get the maximum limit obviously your monthly payments will be will be more than five hundred thousand dollars but td bank overall we love this a bank eight over ten number six folks we have here pnc bank our score 8.5 over 10 and with PNC Bank you have a constellation of products okay and they're very flexible the bank is constantly innovating we love that and uh, their APR is variable based on the Wall Street Journal prime rate and the limits for your uh, personal line of credit $25,000 and the line term is continuous and we love the fact that with TD Bank with the uh, PNC rather with PNC Bank they will review your accounts annually to make sure that everything is fine and you have the option with PNC Bank to have access to capital at the, that will help you uh, do a lot of things. Let's say you're you're asking you're looking for, uh, let's say you are looking for uh, some uh, flexibility in terms of funding. You can get that with PNC Bank. One thing I want to say with PNC Bank is that they do have uh, some drawback, and the drawback is that you can only apply over the phone or in person at a PNC Bank. So they do not have an online application uh, process that will help you basically uh, take care of the apply online. So they want you, they want to see you in person. So you got to go at the branch or you have to apply over the phone. And uh, so if you want to, if you really need the cash and you don't mind putting in a little extra effort when applying, this could be a great solution for you. Okay. So what let's, so PNC Bank, the line of credit, the minimum line, $1,000, the maximum, $25,000. If you are in California, the maximum line amount is $5,000. You have to understand that banking is a state affair. And in California, the restrictions are a little higher in terms of uh, how much you can get. 
and the minimum draw amount fifty dollars okay there is no collateral required and uh, the rate is based upon the wall street journal prime rate and there is no prepayment penalty and the draw period is continuous so we love that so if you want to apply for this uh, line of credit with pnt bank you can apply on the phone one eight seven seven call pnt one eight seven seven call pnc c a l l p n c monday through friday 7 a.m to 10 p.m eastern saturdays through sunday 8 a.m to 5 p.m eastern okay and you can also apply at a branch so this is really good and we love the fact that pnc actually has uh, what they call service members civil relief act uh, program and uh, so there is scra provides financial relief and protections to eligible service members and their dependents and so this is really great we love that okay and pnc is one of the few banks that does that so this is just wonderful so if you happen to be in the military or have been in the military you can uh, actually apply for this uh, business line of credit and consider this scra program so if you want to find out more call 1-844 pnc scra 844-762-7272 okay and uh, you can even fax your information at 855 five six eight forty five thirty two you can email them as service members at pnc.com fantastic number five folks we have truest our score nine over ten so when you think about truest you want to think about sun trust bank Okay, you want to think about BB&T. So this is a great bank. This is a, a national bank. They've been around for a while. I was scoring 9 over 10. And we love the fact that they were very flexible also in terms of allowing you to access your personal line of credit. And uh, you can find, uh, you can actually access the money real quick. They have decisions uh, in a few minutes. Okay, so you, you they can actually fund you within uh, 15 minutes or 30 minutes. As long as you qualify, as long as you have all the, the requirements, that you meet all the requirements, you can tailor your borrowing to fit your budget. Uh, we love that because with Truist, you actually uh, can choose an option with the kind of rate that suits your needs, with a term you can be comfortable with, okay? So whatever your borrowing needs, you are covered. Small loans and lines of credit for the unexpected. You have revolving credit lines for added flexibility, okay? And so this is really So you basically, you can apply in person or you, you can apply by phone. So if you have a Truist account, just call 844-487-8478, 844-487-8478, okay? So you're looking at uh, a maximum, uh, so the minimum credit line is $5,000, and we have seen people actually qualify for a maximum line of credit of $50,000. This is really good. And the uh, APR can oscillate from 8.69% to 25%. Now, if you are, if you're looking for a, uh, the lowest rate you better have excellent credit okay so this is something you need to think about and but they will fund you the same day not a problem with truest with truest we love the fact that they are very fast as long as you have all the, or you meet all the requirements and so if you're looking for accessing revolving credit, a line of credit you want to add extra purchasing power you want to take care of uh, unplanning expenses uh, a wedding or let's say um some kind of work at the house or you're looking for some extra cash to take care of uh, some uh, planned vacation whatever it is whatever it is you want to consider Truist and you also one thing you also need to think about with Truist you do have uh, other so they have the personal line of credit that is unsecured but they also have two other lines of credit that you might want to consider they have a secured line of credit here they have lines starting at twenty five thousand dollars so if you're looking for a higher amount and uh, let's say you want to look for seventy five thousand or one hundred thousand dollars and you do have the funds to back it up to back to back up the application to secure the line of credit go ahead and you can get uh, personal support from a premier banker okay so this is really for folks who have a little bit of cash in their accounts at uh, Trovis. so you, you can consider a secure line of credit or they also have a trust ready now credit line and this is for overdraft or unforeseen expenses so this kind of account has your back lines range from uh, three hundred dollars to seventy five hundred dollars you can avoid fees when you overdraft and this is um, available to clients with the truest checking accounts number four folks we have key bank our score nine over ten and this is kind of cool that we love the fact that with key bank you basically have access to two thousand to twenty five thousand dollars so that's the range here two thousand to twenty five thousand dollars and uh if you are if you're if you're looking for a quick cash 
quick credit to cover the unexpected. This is kind of cool. And we love the fact that with, with KeyBank, they are very fast also. And you can actually apply on the phone. You can apply online if you have an account with them, or you can apply at a branch, okay? Not a problem. They do have flexible payment options. There is no annual fee. This is really good because KeyBank will help you actually manage your liquidity in a very smart way. The interest rate is variable, and the payments are variable. It, they can be principal plus interest, but the loan amount oscillates from $2,000 to $25,000. There is no collateral needed. So this is a purely, this is a pure unsecured line of credit. Okay. And you can actually uh, manage everything online. So when you think about KeyBank, when you think about their line of credit, I want you to think about competitive interest rates, no annual fee, no collateral required. You can borrow up to your loan amount to repay and borrow again. And this can be used for overdraft protection with your key bank checking accounts. So if you're looking to sort of manage your key bank checking accounts in a very smart way, you might want to consider a line of credit. And uh, they do have flexible payment options, including automatic payments. And you have many ways to access your cash, online banking transfers, unlimited check writing, bank teletransaction, branch teletransactions, okay? And uh, you have to understand that you need to, to be to uh to meet certain requirements okay so to apply you must be 18 years or older 18 years of age or older you have to live within the following states so the key bank geographic uh i would say geographic uh footprint so you are looking at um, alaska colorado connecticut idaho indiana massachusetts maine michigan new york ohio oregon pennsylvania utah vermont or Washington State. Okay, you need to agree to provide additional personal and business information if requested, such as tax returns and financial statements. And you need to certify that all the information submitted in the application is true and correct. And you need to authorize the bank and or a credit bureau to investigate the information on the application. Usually, uh, the key bank will actually pull all three credit bureaus. By the way, so all all the players, all the lenders in today's conversation pull from three credit bureaus, all three of them, Experian. Equifax and uh, TransUnion. Okay, so this is gonna this is kind of good. Before I, I move on to the next one, please remember that with KeyBank, you definitely want to be ready. You want to have your financial statements ready, your bank statements, your tax returns. They love that, and this will speed up the process. Number three, folks, we have a PenFed. Our score, 9.5 over 10. Obviously, we are speaking today about banks, and PenFed is a credit union, but we, we still include them here because they are a financial institution, and they, they work in a very similar way that banks do. The only difference is that they do have members, not customers. But yeah, so our score, 9.5 over 10. And with PenFed, of course, as a credit union, you have to be a member. But the good thing is that... Uh, you don't have to be affiliated with the military to qualify. So everybody is, uh, everybody can qualify for a PenFed line of credit or for a PenFed membership, okay? So you have uh, available funds when you need them anytime for anything you want. And with PenFed, credit lines go all the way to $25,000. That's the maximum amount. And uh, the minimum, $10,000. Minimum $1,000, okay? So $1,000 to $25,000. And you can actually uh, get um, the, the funds within... Uh, Three, three, two to three business days, okay? So when you think about that, the APR can go as low as 5.99%. You have free checks to access your line, so this is really good. And PenFed does have a really fast review process, okay? You can apply for a loan and get a decision as soon as tomorrow and, and be funded the next day, okay? So the fast review process will put more time back into your life so you can enjoy what really matters, okay? And you need to understand is that we love the fact that with PenFed, you basically have no annual fee, no collateral. So this is a purely unsecured line of credit. You can borrow up to your credit limits, repay it, then borrow again. And what I love with uh, PenFed is that you basically have uh, some flexibility. The credit union will work with you to make sure that you have the funds that you need. They will make sure that you have uh, all the, do you meet all the requirements? One thing I wanted to say here is that please remember that you need to have uh, some kind of, uh, you need to be prepared also. You want to have your tax returns. You want to, obviously, you need to have a good FICO. Now, FICO score can go all the way to 600. In some cases, we have seen people qualify for a PenFed line of credit with a FICO score of 580. Obviously, it depends on the solidity of your cash flows. It depends on the on the strength of your balance sheet. 
It depends on your NPR, your multi-product relationship with uh, PenFed. Because they will look at the constellation of factors before approving you. They're not just looking at your credit score. Credit score is just one criterion, okay? And this is not the only one. It may be important, but it's not the only one. So think about your credit score. You want to think about uh, your NPR with PenFed. You want to think about your financial statements. So I'm speaking about your balance sheet and your income statement in addition to your statement of cash flows because PenFed will be looking at your uh, your inflows and outflows to see what really met, what was really going on in your financial life. They will sometimes pay attention to your DTI and CUR. So you, they will pay attention to your uh, debt to income ratio as well as your credit utilization ratio. Very important. Number two, folks, we have a US Bank. Our score, 9.5 over 10. So when you think about US Bank, I want you to think about a, a bank personal line of credit that allows you to do nearly everything. The only thing is that they have um, a high requirement for a FICO score, so they want you to have at least 680. Now, we have seen people qualify for this uh, line of credit if they have 620 minimum, but you do need to have a strong relationship with the bank. You know, I've said this before, having a relationship with uh, a lender is critical. It is critical. So if you are a current U.S. Bank checking, US bank checking customer, you can have access to this uh, line of credit and you can actually get the funds instantly, instantly. And you have access to instant ongoing credit access. OK. And uh, we love the fact that uh, you can use your personal line of credit up to twenty five thousand dollars. That's the maximum limit. You can use the money for ongoing access to available funds or if you don't know the full cost of a project. It really depends, especially if you don't want to pledge the equity in your house, for example, and you're just looking for something that is different from a home equity line of credit you might want to consider this personal line of credit and we love that we love the fact that you you only pay interest on the money you borrow making it a great option a great funding option for whatever life throws your way okay think think about it in terms of apr you're looking at uh, a minimum of 10.25 percent and a maximum of 25 percent so you will pay no annual fee with a competitive variable rate and uh, you you'll have the same low apr for advances balance transfers and purchases you have easy access to funds Okay, you can, you can get access to your loan funds via a Visa access card, a personal line access checks, um, a personal line access checks at an ATM online mobile or in a branch. So we love the flexibility that uh, US Bank gives you here. Okay, and uh, overall, here is a lender that has a quick application process. So applying for a personal line of credit only takes a few minutes with uh, their easy and secure online application. Now, did you have? Uh, did you, you always have the possibility of going to a branch, sitting with the with the person, and have a live conversation and explain everything to the person? Okay. And if you are already a U.S. Bank checking customer, you can also start your application in the mobile app or through online banking. And uh, best of the best, when it comes for for a product that comes from a big national bank, there is no collateral required. Think about it. So your personal line of credit with uh, U.S. Bank is unsecured meaning you don't need to put up collateral like your car or house. So this is pretty flexible in terms of uh, managing your cash flows. I'll be right back right after this. Don't go anywhere. Welcome back, folks, to another section of the Awesome Sorted Kiwi Show. We are still having a conversation here about uh, the top seven bank personal lines of credit with easy approval. And uh, number one, the best of the best in our view, Regents Bank. Our score, 10 over 10. And basically, the, uh, the limit here is $50,000. The line term is continuous. We we'll love that. And uh, the APR is variable based on the Wall Street Journal prime rate. So with Regions Bank, you have to think about a bank that offers flexible, convenient personal lines of credit to borrowers. So you have to understand that they have a high limit, $50,000. This is really good. And they are able to actually fund whatever projects you, wanna, you want to uh, you're currently working on okay and uh they do have a few fees though they have an annual fee of fifty dollars an over limit fee of twenty nine dollars and a late fee of thirty five thousand uh thirty five dollars not thirty five thousand thirty five dollars okay you can apply online for a personal line of credit but you do need to already you need to have a relationship with the bank in other words you need to have uh, an existing region's uh, customer checking account to qualify if you want to apply online however if you want to apply over the phone or in person, you don't have to be an existing 
you don't have to have an existing relationship with the bank okay and we love the fact that uh, with regions preferred line of credit you can borrow as much as uh, you want or as little as you need depending on your credit limits and uh, this requires this line of credit requires no collateral and you can use it for home improvement projects car repairs or unexpected expenses okay and uh, so the minimum line amount three thousand dollars the maximum line amount fifty thousand dollars and uh, we love the fact that, that now what about the repayment frequency and amount now a monthly repayment of principal and interest so you have three percent of your outstanding balance or fifty dollars whichever is greater okay and you can actually uh, they have rate discounts available for line amounts five thousand dollars or greater if you would like to have your monthly payments automatically debited from your regions checking accounts through their automatic payment options so you know, as long as you have auto pay this is really good and the amount of the discount varies based on your type of relationship with the uh, regions ranging from 0.25 percent to 0.50 percent so that's basically uh, a discount off the apr that you're paying that you're paying okay and uh, one thing we have seen with um, with regions is that they do have uh, they do have uh, you can close the loan at a branch not a problem not a problem and you also need to understand that they were really great in terms of working with uh, you if you have no collateral okay you can apply over the phone if, if you are interested if you want to apply over the phone the number is 1-888-462-7627 Monday through Friday 6 a.m. through what, 7 p.m. and uh, Saturday 8 a.m. to uh, 2 p.m. let me quickly have a quick conversation with you about uh, a uh, line of credit a personal line of credit from a bank so when you're thinking about a personal line of credit from a bank you want to start with a relationship you want to start with the bank you currently bank with with the institution you currently bank with it's a, it's really important to start with uh, the lender you already know right instead of uh, going and, uh, and applying for a uh, for a line of credit at TD Bank if you are a Regents Bank go with TD Bank first you want to first uh, go with the lender that you know and you want to beef up the relationship you have uh, with the current lender before applying and one thing you need to do when you apply for a, a personal line of credit, you want to compare interest rates. It's really important. You want to note the fees. There, there could be an origination fee, a draw fee, a maintenance fee, whatever it is. You want to read the fine prints. Please do me a favor right now. I want you to write down that you need to read the fine prints. Important. You want to understand the repayment process. Some banks, some, some banks want you to repay them over 12 months, over 24 months, or 36 months if you have a review process that is continuous okay you want to consider how funds are, are withdrawn do you want do you are you withdrawing the funds uh, through access checks through online transactions at the atm whatever you want to pay attention to collateral the good thing is that in today's conversation all the seven banks that i've been, I've been speaking to you about do require no collateral in other words you're not pledging anything you're not pledging your house you're not pledging your, your your car not at all and you want to check online reviews and you want to watch shows like this that review uh, the, those lenders before applying it's really important to understand that at the end of the day you have to be very clear about why you need the funds do you need the money for uh, do you need the money for unexpected expenses Okay, because there are, there are many reasons to consider a personal line of credit for. You have a constant access to funds. You can draw only what you need. You pay interest only on the amount you draw from the account. So after you pay off debts, you can start using a line of credit. Again, it's like a credit card. It's kind of similar to a credit card. You don't need to provide, a, to provide collateral, and you can use the money as you wish, okay? And uh, the bottom line here is that, please, pay attention to the credit line types. Pay attention to the borrowing amount and terms, the APR, the eligibility criteria. You want to pay attention to the fees and the customer support. Before I close today's conversation, please check out this short loan evaluation approach. We do have a rigorous method on this show when it comes to evaluating, categorizing, and listing personal lines of credit. Check this out. folks this is the end, of the end of today's conversation i was talking to you about the top seven personal lines of credit from uh, big 
national banks. Number one, Regions Bank, 10 over 10. Number two, we have a U.S. Bank, 9.5 over 10. Number three, we have PenFed, 9.5 over 10. Number four, we have Key Bank, 9 over 10. Number five, we have a Truist, 9 over 10. Number six, we have a PNC Bank, 8.5 over 10. Number seven, last but not the least, we have a TD Bank at 8 over 10. Thank you so much for your attention. I really appreciate it. I'll speak to you another time. But until then, remember, stay marvelous.